Hey, 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 welcome back to What Time? Paul Marriott here. After yesterday's update video to the Side Load Channel Launcher 2 review, where I basically said there was still one thing missing from this launcher, I woke up to an email this morning. Ah, and I am like a kid at Christmas. So let's get into it. Let's get stuck in. What time? Will it take time? So if you did see yesterday's video, you know what I'm talking about. If you didn't, all will be revealed in just a moment. But first, let me ask for everybody's help. If you've either got Sideload Launcher 2 or not, what is it that makes a great launcher for you? Tell us down in the comments. What would you need out of a launcher? What features make a launcher? What features would you want out of a launcher? So that's more or less how our screen looked in the last video. And in today's video, this is what I'm all excited about. Look at that. Yes, we have a power button. My wife didn't really understand that I got all excited about this. But anyway, anyone who has a shield and has played with launchers will know that having a power button on your home screen is important. NVIDIA Shield users will remember back in uh, NVIDIA Experience 6, back in the old days, there used to be a power button. And when they came to Vi NVIDIA experience seven it went a lot of people were upset well now you can get it back and with the flexibility of this launcher you can of course put them back on the home screen on the normal nvidia atv android television home screen yay so how do you do it okay so we come down to the very bottom of the screen on the right hand side there the left hand of those two icons is the to configure the launcher go in there open admin mode and we're going to go up to that row there and we are going to add a custom tile in this case it has to be a custom tile and i'm not going to give it a name for the moment not important i'm going to make it a square tile to make it smaller and then for the icon we're going to I'm going to use one from the icon pack. There's a link to that from this GO icon pack. There's a link to that in the description of the video. And what we're going to look for is an icon, the one that I'm going to use because there's no specific icon for this. The one that I'm going to use is called a win. Let's find it. Win source. That'll do. Let's take that first one. We're going to come down to actions. This is important. Go in there. And we come down to NVIDIA power menu. Click that. Come across and save it. Save it. OK, whilst we're at it, let's change the icon on that to make it prettier edit tile square tile again go in there come down to icon pack down to the geo icon pack and this time we're going to go to um, s for settings and come down and find a nice one for, from the settings let's use that one and accept that come down save that and then whilst we're there in the row we're going to change the tile on there although it's edit row we're going to again from the icon pack again from s for settings we'll use the other one that was there S for settings and then come right down to that one and we'll use that for the row icon. Let's align it to the right and that way it will be just above the launcher configuration icon. Save that and we're going to save a copy there to the head to the home screen on the look on the on the Nvidia shield come down to there close off the admin mode and that will bring up the power dialog there we go all usual power so power off 
OK. But I'm not going to press OK at the moment because I want to carry on with this. And then on the other one, we have the settings. And that works as well. OK, let's just take a peek over on the NVIDIA home screen. And if we come right down the bottom, there's the one we've just added. And let's just move it up. We're going to leave it at the top for the moment. There you go. Power button on the top of the home screen on the NVIDIA Shield. How about that? Right, so let's go back to the... There we are. So there you have it. All set up. Nice little power button on the side load launcher channel to home screen. Done. The method I've just shown you uses icons from an icon pack. Here's something I did with my own custom made icons. And also the icons and tiles at the, on the top two rows are also custom made. Amongst other things, we're currently working on a video to show you how to make custom, custom icons for your launcher, whether it be this one or any other. So any questions? As I mentioned earlier, please leave a comment down below to tell us what you need, what you want, what you expect from a launcher. How can this launcher be improved? Hope you've enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. We'll catch you when you catch us in the next one. Toodle pip.